Hey guys, what's up? I'm vlogging with Sarvesh. So today, I'm going to be sharing a Vedic matrix that will help us find the sum of any group of numbers with any number of digits. So what are we waiting for? Let's get started. Yes guys, you have heard it right. You're going to add any number of digits uh, numbers. So let's take any three digit numbers. Say 7, 0, 2, 882 and 806. Okay. So now we have to see what is the hundreds place. 7 is the hundreds place for 702. 8 is the hundreds place for 882 and 8 is again the hundreds place for 806. Now we have to add all the hundreds place. So now we need to add 7 plus 8 plus 8. We we'll just put them in brackets. Multiplied by 100 since all of these are the hundreds place. We get what we get is 7 plus 8 plus 8 is 23 into 100 gives us 2300 0, 0, 2300 now we'll take the tens place we'll just circle the tens place 0 is the tens place in 702 8 is the tens place in 882 and again 0 is the tens place of 806 we'll add all of them 0 plus 8 plus 0 into 10 because uh, 0, 8 and 0 are the tens place gives us 8 into 10 equal to 80. So the sum of the tens place is 80. Now we'll take the ones place. 2 plus 2 plus 6 into 1 because 2, 2 and 6 are the ones place gives us 10 into 1. That's nothing but 10. Now, the sum of 2300, 80 and 10 is the sum of 702, 882 and 806. Now, we'll just add them. So, 2300 plus 80 plus 10. What we get is 2390. So, guys, now we'll take, like, say, four numbers, four, four, four digit numbers. Let's take them randomly, say 1,000, 12, 2,983 and say 8,601 and 9,880. Yeah, so now we need to uh, first of all take the, uh, mark the thousands place. In all of these numbers. So, 1 is the thousands place of 1012. 2 is the thousands place of 2983. 8 is the thousands place of 8601. Similarly, 9 is the thousands place of 880. 9880. Yeah. We have to take the sum of all of these thousands place. So, we'll just add them. 1 plus 2 plus 8 plus 9 into thousand since all of these are the thousands place gives us one plus two plus eight plus nine is twenty so twenty into thousand that is twenty thousand now we need to take the sum of all the hundreds place so I just you know take to denote uh, the tick denotes the hundred place for all of these numbers. So zero is the hundred place for one thousand twelve. Nine is the hundred place for two thousand nine hundred eighty three. Six is the hundred place for eight thousand six hundred one. And eight is the hundred place for nine thousand eight hundred eighty. We'll just take the sum of all of the hundred place. Say zero plus nine plus 6 plus 8 into 100 since all of these are the hundreds place of all of these numbers so we'll just take the sum of these numbers the sum is 23 
Now we need to multiply 23 with 100. We get 2300. Now we need to take the sum of all the tens place. I'll just encircle the tens place so that it's easy for you guys. So 1 is the tens place for 1012. 8 is the tens place for 2983. 0 is the tens place for 8601. And 8 again is the tens place for 9880. Okay. Now I have to take the sum of all of the tens place of these following numbers. So I'll take the sum of, I'll take the sum. 1 plus 8 plus 0 plus 8 into 10 is the sum of all of the tens place of these numbers. So we get, what we get is 17 into 10. That is 170. Now, at the end, we have to take the sum of the ones place. That's nothing but 2 plus 3 plus 1 plus 0 into 1. That is 6. Yeah. Now, when you take the sum of all of these numbers, the sum of 20,000, 2,300, 170 and 6 is the sum of all of these numbers. So let's just take the sum. 20,000 plus 2,300 plus 170 uh, plus 170 plus 6 gives us 22,300. Guys, I'll just uh, like, you know, I will group these numbers. So I'll group this and this, this and this. So, this and this. Yeah. So, the sum of 20,000 and 2,300 is 22,300. Plus 170 plus 6. 170 plus 6 is 176. And now I'll just find the sum of 22,300 plus 176. So, the sum we get is 22,476. Yes, friends, this is the answer. This 22,476 is the sum of 1,012, 2,983, 8,601, 9,880. Guys, this trick is very helpful for competitive exams and school exams. Guys, this trick helps us to find the sum of any number of digits very quickly without the actual school taught method. So guys, you can use this trick in daily life. Thank you and I vlogging with Sarvesh will be back with another Vedic Math video soon. Stay tuned. Bye and do subscribe.